Hello, P here, French Kids Good Nature, and uh, just want to show you what I've been working on here. Uh, you can see down in here, it's my water container. Somebody gave me a cooler. I took the guts out, and what was I was gonna do originally was cut a hole in the back of here, wood burners down here, and put that cooler in here so I had two double doors on the inside. So don't know if I like that idea or not, because then it punches a hole in there. So then I started getting out here and getting into this dirt and digging. And if you can see, I used to have a giant tree. Went all the way through here. The other half of it is right there. So this tree used to come all the way through this here, all the way down and all the way through here. So then I started digging and I decided that after once I got it out of the way that what I should do is oops sorry. Uh, what I should do is uh I've been thinking about a screen and porch. And so instead of a screen and porch and instead of a the whole nine yards, I am gonna make walls here. So if you can see here. I dug these giants, big stones, out of down in here, down in the dirt. And I wedged them with leverage and stones, and I walked them over here, started creating a wall. This right here is going to be my doorway. And this is going to be a wall going up here. This tree right here is going to be on the inside. The wall is going to go up the side up to there and then I'll go across the top and then you see this locust right here it's a dead locust look up top that thing is dead so what I want to do with this locust is I want to build this wall through here on the outside of the locust and keep this dead locust on the inside because even though it's dead it'll definitely stand here for another 30 or 40 years if it's not exposed to weather so if we look across here, there we go, the other side of this wall right here, this is the wall that's going to come right down through here, and then it's going to go right across the top out there. And then these, this is locust, it's locust post, and that's a locust right there. we got the sunlight in there. So basically I'm going to put a beam across here, and that's going to carry this angle all the way through. So I will be cutting these even though they're dead. They're still positive because they're going to go on the inside of the wall. If you can see the corner of my pallet cabin, we're going to create a wall down through here. We'll back ourselves up here. There we go. So now you can see the corner of it where I've dug down. That area right here is going to be a wall coming all the way through. Then this tulip poplar right here is going to run that, you see that stone down there? That's going to be the inside wall. And right now I'm two feet below grade over there by the pal by the cabin, I'm two foot below grade. So I'll probably be about four, four foot below grade right up in there. We'll see how it goes. But I'm thinking that instead of a screen room, this little wine room or food cellar or air conditioning will be a lot nicer to sleep in once you have mortared walls and a insulated roof in this little area. So that's the idea and that's what I've been working on. So uh, it's Pete Magic Good Nature. I got the pond in the back and the uh, pallet cabin with the uh, eye window right there. And I'm going to have rainwater collection here eventually. So thanks for watching and be peaceful. I'll see you in the woods. Talk to you soon. So what I want to show you was, these are the only tools I'm using for this project so far. Tomahawk, crowbar, wrecking bar, uh, I would call it like a Maddox, maybe with a grub hole, a pick on one side, but it's more like an axe on one side and a shovel, and that's it. And that's what I'm using to 
put this whole dig out this whole cellar area so check it out there's a full view of what it's gonna look like I'm gonna go across the top there down here and forward to there so there you go that's uh only worked on it one day I think I got at least three or four days left maybe longer but pretty frantic in nature and thanks for watching and stay peaceful see you later